the 70-year-old Imran Khan, Pakistan's former prime minister and legendary former cricketer, enjoys astronomical popularity and star appeal. His arrest triggered chaos and violent protests by his supporters across Pakistan. Khan is the most popular leader in Pakistan, with 61% of people having positive views about him. The Daily Times reported citing a nationwide survey conducted by Gallup Pakistan. According to the report, Mr. Khan received a positive rating from 61 PC of the population, while 37, while 37 C rated him negatively. Observers say that the former PM is not just a political leader for his followers, but a messiah, like figure. For one, though Imran Khan had developed into an astute political leader and become an almost messiah, like figure among his supporters, he is not regarded as a traditional politician. He remains Pakistan's most popular sporting idol, and for a cricket, crazy Pakistan bringing home the 1992 World Cup was the icing on the cake. As a cricketer, he was one of the greatest captains of all time. He was considered the best all-rounder during his cricketing career. He led Pakistani cricket team to 1992, Odi World Cup's victory the only OD World Cup won by Pakistan till now. He is said to have been the A-maker of many of the great cricketers of Pakistan like Wasim Akram and Wakar Yunis, attacking the corrupt elite. Khan's strategy has been to maintain pressure on the country's corrupt political parties by building a narrative and dividing the society into the pure people and the corrupt elite. According to the Express Tribune, even after becoming the prime minister in 2018, Khan continued to raise the issue of his predecessor government's corruption. This is why his arrest becomes more significant, as it is in a corruption case. Khan has reportedly been booked in over 140 cases, including defamation, terrorism, and corruption. But even if he is indicted, he is unlikely to lose the backing of his core voter base. Charming the youth. Khan's promise of a Naya Pakistan has found resonance with the country's youth. His party has effectively used social media to engage the youth, which comprises nearly 65% of the total population. Sitara Noor, an independent political and security analyst from Pakistan, told Outlook, Khan's popularity has developed independently of the army. It is widely believed that the same army had propped up Khan in 2018 to get rid of Nawaz Sharif. However, the Pitai chief has fallen from the all-powerful military's grace since he started attacking officials openly, even blaming former army chief Kamar Javed Bawa for his ouster. His popularity has only surged since he was ousted from power in April last year through a no-confidence motion. Though Khan has been in politics since forming the PTA in 1996, he is not regarded as part of the corrupt Pakistani political clique made up of the Bhutto Sirdaris and the Sharif brothers and the old landed elite of Pakistan. Yet there are also serious allegations of unaccounted foreign money pouring in for the PT in Imran Khan. However, even if the case is proven, it will make little difference to Ick's image as such allegations are brushed off by his loyal supporters as the machinations of his political opponents. To many in Pakistan, Imran Khan is the knight in shining armor, restoring Pakistan's image in the world. Pai is not exactly a political party which evolved naturally over time, but rather a messiah-centered personality cult. Core supporters are more ideological, having been successfully tutored in Pakistani textbook nationalism and are enthralled by Imran, who, in their opinion, is the embodiment of patriotism and religious devotions writes Raza Habib Raja columnist of the Express Tribune. Unfortunately, political and religious polarization seems to be the hallmark of today's politics, whether in the US, India, or Pakistan. Analysts in Pakistan, analysts in Pakistan say that the hold of the old feudal and political aristocracy in Pakistan is gradually fading. This is being replaced by the new middle class that is slowly emerging in both rural and urban centers in Pakistan. The new middle class has contempt for the old politicians and their corrupt ways. They look up to Imran Khan as the symbol of the new Pakistan, says Sitara Noor. 
Due to his charismatic personality and his cricket legacy, Khan has managed to engage the otherwise indifferent silent majority of the country, who traditionally did not become part of the political process. They are even willing to let go of his shortfalls as a political leader in his first term and still believe in his promise of change and are willing to give him a second chance. Pakistan's coalition government is finding it more and more difficult to deal with Imran Khan. It is thrashing around trying to ensure he does not return. The speculation is that the allegations of foreign funding may be a serious setback for the Pai. A total of 13 hidden foreign accounts were identified. Moreover, Imran Khan submitted a false declaration before the 2018 elections saying he had received no money from abroad. Some of the money came from us, UK, UK, and Australia. According to reports, 34 transactions were identified by the investigating team. However, Khan's dramatic arrest by the paramilitary rangers is believed to have the blessings of the Pakistan army. Now, how long will Khan's supporters continue to hit the streets will depend on the army's response to the current unrest in the country.